கோபால் டிபி டூ சிஐசிஎஸ் ஸோ திஸ் ப்ரோக்ராம் யூ ஹேவ் டு கிவ் ஐ திங்க் ஃப்ரீ கம்பைலர் ஓகே ஐ திங்க் கிக்ஸ் ட்ரான்ஸ்லேட்டர் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் கம்பிலேஷன் ப்ரொசீஜர் then free compiler then bind plan and free compiler goes to compiler and then link edit and then load mode so cobol db to kicks first kicks translator is going to convert all kicks commands into move on call statement it is going to co- mean comment out all kicks commands and replace with move on call statements pre compiler is going to comment out all db to sql commands and replace with move on call statements and sql statements alone come here as a dbrm dbrm is going to bind and create a plan and here it's cobol compiler is going to check for cobol syntax errors link init is going to link all the load modules link like ilb oa bn0 whatever if you have they create load module if you have any kicks command errors you have to come and see here if you have sql errors you have to come and see here and here we have cobol syntax errors you have to come and see here if you have, if you have errors in link edit it's a link link errors program link errors so here this is four is okay only in training mainframe here pre compiler should be return code zero kicks translator i think should be zero cobol compiler can be zero or four link edit should be zero these are written codes anything other than written rc 0 or 4 is invalid now we have five steps one so two third step fourth step fifth step okay you all understand what is uh, this and here uh, five steps probably can take a screenshot a small screen chart i'll be explaining this again on uh, saturday because db2 pre compilation procedure is a very important interview question okay i haven't explained it fully db2 pre compilation procedure is a very very important interview question even if you have 10 years experience even 12 years experience that's a very common interview question and people ask because people don't know how to ask questions also that's a problem you already have this map right so mps1 or mps2 some people created mps1 some people created in mps2 you use whatever you have defined and program name use either uh, pgm1 or 2 or 3 not pgm4 okay and map name is going to be okay gamma number a so a is the map name sorry plan name you cannot use any other plans apart from this like a b c d e f you cannot use so use one of these map sets for this program and use one of these program names if so these map sets are already there you can use it program what you do you rename the program okay rename any one program to pgm3 to some other or pgm2 you can take it up so pgm2 or pgm1 or pgm3 take any program rename it and uh, the new program have this name and then use plan a only because that's how it is defined and all these definitions are by administrators in project so they'll be giving the program name plan name and map name you are just going to use it 